This video is on representation theory and we introduce the concept, the very important concept of irreducible representation. Okay, so let this phi be a representation, of course a non-zero representation, a representation that takes us from G to the general linear group uh, on the vector space V of a group G. Uh, so this representation is said to be uh, irreducible if the only G invariant subspaces of V uh, please check the previous videos for the, um, the concept of G invariant subspace of a vector space so if the only G invariant subspaces of the vector space V are the trivial ones, so zero and uh, V itself. Okay. A very first example, any degree one representation from phi from the group G to the non-zero complex numbers is irreducible. This one is irreducible since the complex um, have no proper non-zero subspace. Okay, so this one will be very first example of an irreducible representation. So um, we just saw that any degree one representation is irreducible, right? Uh, so let us look again at this uh, table. Let us pick, for instance, the group, um, the trivial group, okay, only the identity. So if now we pick a representation from the group to the general linear group, this is a representation. Well, right, it is, yes. So, phi of the identity will have to be the matrix identity, right? So, to give a representation of the, this uh, trivial group is the same thing as to give a, uh, a vector space, right? So, for the, the trivial group, a only for the trivial group, right? The G invariant subspace is the vector subspace is the same. So the representation here is the same as in the, the vector space. Okay. So a representation of the trivial group is irreducible if and only if it has degree one. Okay. So it will be irreducible if it is a one-dimensional subspace. Okay, so you see that on degree one, this column and this column they are uh, being the same on on degree one. So I just repeated here this, the the proposition. I don't want any confusion. So a representation of the trivial group is irreducible if and only if it has degree 1. So I give here a second example of a representation that is not irreducible. So a, a representation is called reducible, irreducible. A representation phi from G to general, general linear group is irreducible if the only G invariant subspaces of V are the trivial ones, okay. So here we saw an example of a degree one representation, and of course a degree one representation is reducible. And here we have a representation that we saw on a previous video. So phi 
takes its representation from the group, the factor group Z by NZ to the general linear group. Um, and this representation is given by this uh, matrix. Okay, this is the, the, the rotation, right? Uh, the very famous rotation cosine 2 pi m n, where m is this and n will be this, uh, this, this n here. Okay, so um, this representation is not irreducible. Okay, uh, there was another example too. I, I'll, I'll go back and, and, and get it. I think that we had an example a representation with phi and another one was psi. I'm going to, to get the other one. The other one must must not be reducible to. I, I'll check in a sec. Okay, this one is not reducible. Why? Um, uh, because, um, for instance, um, this uh, i and 1 this one and uh, minus i one here. Please check if I'm not making any mistake. Okay, um, these ones they are g uh, invariant subspaces of v. Well, g in our case, g is this factor group, right? So they are. Uh, z by n z in variant uh, subspaces uh, for uh, for phi okay uh, so since these two are invariant subspaces of course the, the there are more in very subspaces than the trivial ones, right? Um, so I'm going to get okay. So it's not only zero and the um, the, the vector space itself. We have other invariant subspaces. So this representation is not irreducible. So I'm going to search for this. I think there was another one. There was phi and then there was psi. Well, yes, the other one was this psi. So psi was also a taking from this group to the general linear group. Um, and it was taken through this uh, matrix. But uh, the the only invariant subspaces are not the trivial ones because here uh, for instance any if you pick the the axis you see the the coordinate axis they are invariant subspaces of, of psi so psi psi is not irreducible Okay, we have more invariant subspaces, um, more invariant subspaces than the trivial ones.